said, darling, darling I'm feeling rich although I'm poor I said, darling, darling In your arms I feel secure Darling, darling ooh, 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 yeah, girl You know I miss you, baby You know I miss you My nail was said, I was like, hi guys welcome back to my channel for those of you who don't know me my name is Gugu I am also known as Sne underscore Gugulechi on all my social media platforms feel free to follow me because I really do drop some premium content and that's on period to all my returning subscribers my day one my VIP king 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 thank you so much for coming back for yet another video and if you're new here and you see my beautiful face for the first time and you're thinking to yourself who is this gorgeous gorgeous Han <laughs> my name is Gugu I hope you stay I hope you fall in love and I definitely definitely hope you hit the subscribe button and become part of my family welcome to a new vlog guys I am so sick my husband infected me with flu and today is Monday I went live with a vlog on yesterday on a Sunday and when I tell you I've been sleeping the whole weekend I mean it luckily I'm on my husband's um, medical aid like I used to have a medical aid at James most and you guys know I left that part of my life in the past so my husband added me to um, his medical aid and um, I went to the doctor got some meds and I feel a little bit better but I can still feel like I can still feel that I am sick. Um, I really did try to avoid him. Let me tell you, Nem. I don't get sick. Me, Kuku, Kanana. I do not get sick. But the man I'm married to gets sick so easily, guys. My husband will catch flu. We'll walk in the rain, and he literally. I could walk outside not in the rain I could walk outside and maybe let's say it's drizzling and like two three four drops will fall on both of us that man will become sick the following day he'll have flu so um, I don't get sick he does and after he gets sick he infects me I try to avoid him I try to keep my distance but we are taller guys <laughs> He 
gets me even now baby please don't come don't come close to me you wanna get me infected with flu because in my line of work if i'm sick like now i had to wake up create content and if i'm sick you wanna see what um what is wrong <laughs> you're not well so um i was creating content for a campaign on instagram but i feel like it like you can't really tell because i feel like I, I'm, I'm better but yeah um, i tried to avoid him he got me i got sick and yeah i'm healing though it's fine i start i signed guys they hold my face i went like through thickness and in health <laughs> here's the sickness <laughs> anyway guys um not you guys dragging me on my last vlog for using my um home language and the only people that dragged me is the people who were not understanding what i was saying like Google, please don't use use english on your vlogs guys you guys know i use english on my vlogs to all my international subbies i am so sorry uh but i do understand why you were complaining but if you heard what i was saying you were not gonna complain because i was holding everything basically what i was saying on the last vlog in my home language which is ndebele i was saying that um i know i promised you guys a breakdown of how much i make in a month um just to give you an idea on how much if you want to get an influence if you want to get into influencing or you want to get into um youtube like how much would you make because i gave you guys an example which uh like in march i made twenty seven thousand rents on youtube and then um sorry sorry guys flu so like like i gave an example last month that i made 27,000 rands on youtube and someone came and asked Tuguchi, is that all like is that your entire income on youtube and i feel like i gave you guys the perception that that's where it ends and I, I i get the question i really get it and i'm one person who doesn't mind sharing information because i believe by lighting another candle it will not dim my um my own light and someone is saying like yeah Google, don't share those things with people like if i'm helping someone guys um i don't mind this thing is not like a salary advice if you know this year if you're getting paid forty thousand rents a year then you know next month on the 31st you're gonna get paid that 40 40k into your account on content creation yesterday's price it's definitely not today's price like if i was charging um a certain price when i was on forty thousand uh, subscribers i'm not gonna charge the same price at fifty two thousand subscribers next day if i hit 60 i'm not gonna attack i'm not gonna charge um the same price so that's why i feel so comfortable sharing because i know last month i made 27k this month is, it's higher it, it it grows like you grow with with being consistent with um working with more brands uh with even with putting out your own work out there you grow you gain numbers and the more numbers you gain uh the more um numbers go uh side hand in hand with uh engagement but i will explain all of that in um at the end of the vlog and the reason i spoke my home language in my other video in my last real wow <laughs> the reason i spoke my home language in my last um uh youtube video was because that video was sponsored by people that i wanted to mention because it forms part of my income so i get paid so they pay me a certain amount and i wanted to give you guys like accurate numbers show screenshots and whatnot and i felt uncomfortable uh talking about them in a video that they are paying me for so i was like mm. And people were like, oh, did you sign a non-disclosure agreement? I did not, but I felt uncomfortable talking about them in a video that they're paying for. What else I could do that in a separate video? So I was basically explaining that in my home language. And those who got it, got it. If you didn't get it, I'm so sorry. And I couldn't write subtitles because they were going to read them. So when a video is sponsored, I do the video, I submit it to them. They watch the video, so they check uh, things like there's no... Um, uh bad language like i'm not swearing there's no racism there's no like you all you know all of those things is it uh child friendly and stuff like that like does my video align like does my vlog align with their brand so i need to submit it to them then they check and then they approve it then i post it so obviously if i'm talking yeah um skillshare is paying me and then i'm, I'm sending that to them it's better if someone 
screenshots it and sends it to them oh she was talking about you rather than for me to just do that like just come for them like that so yeah that's why that's what i was saying on my video uguti um i was saying that uh, i will tell you guys about my income in the next video that is all i swear there was no gossip there was nothing vile that's what i said and i'm so sorry um i feel like i could never win with the home language thing because people are always saying um yeah Kuku, but um you don't speak enough of your home language like how come you don't speak in the belly and then others say why are you speaking in the belly? we can't hear you and i feel like guys <laughs> <laughs> I even tried now I've upgraded I'm adding subtitles because I'm trying to please everyone I know I can't please all of you but I'm, I'll try nonetheless anyway I don't want this intro to be too long it's already on eight minutes oh guys sorry I almost forgot um, I started off this vlog by going to an event a Maybelline event uh, initially I wanted <laughs> To open the vlog before I even go to the event, but I was so late. Like I was so late, there was no time. Uh, so I just want to show you the um, gift bag that we got, the goodie bag that we got from the event. So I wanted to come and unbox what we got at the event. Um, Le Vinley lipstick. Um, so the whole uh, event was around this Vinley ink lipstick, and we also got. I don't know where I'm gonna use this Maybelline <laughs> an actual Vinley um, I get the concept but where am I gonna use this guys where am I going to use this oh it's still new because it was oh there we go and I said a pigmentation of the Vinley lipsticks it is. So I just wanted to show you guys the pigmentation of these lipids. If you find you can find them on Take a Lot, Discam, Clicks. Would I recommend this highly, highly, highly if you love matte pigmented lipsticks? This is your girly. <laughs> I can explain. <laughs> I can't explain oh my god so this top is new and uh, I was trying on outfits like I'm telling you I want to create content from my Instagram so I was trying out outfits and I wanted to style it with these shoes so I bought it and I've never worn it so I was just wearing it to um, see how it looks on me and then um, I just wore it for the sit down and then um, I just noticed like I have a thingy hanging out a tag price tag hanging from the um, you know what you guys get this for me <laughs> bye <laughs>
yourself, but you'll miss me when it's getting late. Got it all, babe. Save arms when you're ready. I'm here when you need me. I'm yours if you'll let me. Got it all, babe. Save arms when you're ready. I'm here when you need me. I'm yours if you let go. I'm almost done with the pop. I didn't want to go like back for some more. Check my pop is almost finished. I didn't want to have a lot of pop, but I feel like I'm gonna go back for some more. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Mm. Oh, back to my roots. Nick. sauce guys i put my foot in it <laughs> it's so good <laughs> mm. hi guys so we're here at the grand pavilion in sea point and we're doing outfit of the day outside <laughs> So the top is from Zara, jean is from Zara, and sneakers are Lacoste. Show them your jacket, but they know this. They know this jacket. In case it gets cold. There you go, let me move this side because I can't see the full view. Yes! Woo, baby! <laughs> <laughs> Say bye. bye guys. <laughs> Hi guys, uh, that's my beautiful wife, and I'm doing outfit of the day. <laughs> so, what are you wearing? Baby, the jacket? Zara. The and top, Mr. Price. Mr. Price. Mango. The and Steve Madden. Let me show them the shoes. No, baby, my toes are ugly. <laughs> <laughs> And then my coach bag. Your coach bag. So let me show them the complete outfit. Sugumam Gambak Born.
what it took to make it new Like a blossom of a tree Or the color of a jewel So divine Is the feeling that I find Like a sweet mountain breeze And a fragment of my mind I said, darling You are all I want for sure Darling Give me everything and more I said, darling Ooh, ooh, ooh Yeah, girl You know I miss you mm -hmm. Slide talking, girl, you're in circles through my mind And it seems like every day Just gets better when you're mine When you love now and forever For my hurt you are the cure Like a spring you keep me healthy With a substance that is pure And I said darling, darling Feeling rich although I'm poor I said darling in your arms I feel secure Darling Darling ooh, 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 Yeah girl You know I miss ya Baby You know I miss ya Oh yeah You know I miss ya Baby You know I miss ya No, I miss you And I said, darling Oh, darling You are all I want for sure All I want for sure Darling, darling In your arms I feel secure I feel secure Darling, darling Feeling rich although I'm poor I said, darling Darling Give me everything and more I said, darling I miss ya Oh, baby Oh you know I miss you, darling mm. you know I miss you, baby mm. you know I miss you, baby Tomorrow. Hello? Hello, how are you? Good, thanks, how are you? I'm very well, thank you. Ah, it's Robert from Checkers here. Yeah? Yes, you need a pin? Yes, please. I'm already at the gate here. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna send it now. Oh, okay. Thank you. Thanks, bye. Guys, let me quickly send. I ordered a few things from Checkers. I just want to quickly send a password so he can enter. And then we can continue with our business. And send. Anyway, uh, these are the packages I went to get at Concierge. This is uh, a wig thingy. I'm not going to open this now. Guys, I think I have like five or six wigs waiting for me to do Shana, to do reviews. I'm going to start with this. Oh my word, this I love this so much. Oh, before I start, the coat that I showed you guys last time on my vlog okay he's coming in the checkers guy is coming in the um, uh, coat that i showed you that i'm gonna put a picture here remember i said i was like oh my god i don't know how to style this it doesn't look good i think i'm gonna return it i think i'm gonna keep it guys i ended up styling it and it is 
gorgeous like it's so stunning i felt like that day i was rushing things and i really didn't have time to like put together a proper outfit but i'm not gonna try on uh, stuff today because i feel like if i'm doing like a rush work of trying on stuff i just yeah i just end up being all over the place but once i style the outfits i do post them on my instagram this is my instagram page do follow me there i post fashion and lifestyle on my instagram so everything that i unbox here ultimately ends up on my instagram page currently sitting on 117,000 subscribers my goal for this year is 150,000 followers did i say subscribers 150,000 i'm currently on 117,000 uh followers on instagram my target for this year is 150,000 well if i wish that i'll be very very happy okay i talk a lot let me start so i got this oh my god isn't this gorgeous I got this knit coat, um, I wanted to say coat, uh, this knit jersey at H&M, actually bought it on, um, I actually bought it online, uh, by online I mean superb list and I love it so much, I feel like this color would also go with that jacket that I was telling you guys about, it's like I'm gonna put a picture here, the quality is wow i don't know i love this this is really really nice i can't wait to rock this the quality is exceptional i really really love the quality and the price of this was there's no price here i think it was 400 i'm not sure i'm gonna put a screenshot here i don't remember i bought it last week but i think they still have them on superbalist if you like it you can get it zara and here we go. I haven't opened this. I just opened the box for... Oh, I know what it is. <laughs> and here they are. Oh my god. I love them so, so much. Um, oh, I know we are in winter, ne? I know, I know we're in winter, but I feel like these are so beautiful, like these are so gorgeous and I'm definitely going to need them in summer, so I really wanted to grab them now before they sell out, because I'm sure by the time it's summer they would have uh, been sold out, I'm not going to even open them, I'm going to keep them in the box and pack them away. I'm a Zara junkie, like I am addicted to anything Zara, here they are together. Aren't these gorgeous? Aren't these gorgeous? I love them so much. Now to the last part of the video. How much do I make on YouTube in a month? Okay, so the reason I am doing this is because obviously uh, a few people did ask me, Buti, how do you make, how much do, would you make like as a content creator in YouTube and Instagram? And the reason I'm answering it so honestly is because I wish uh, when I was starting out or when I was thinking of starting um, I had at least an idea of how much I could earn it's because when you study certain courses at school you know which okay if I'm being a doctor I'm gonna earn between this amount and this amount depending on how long you've been practicing obviously and if I'm a nurse I can make this much to this much if I'm an engineer I can make from you know you know your salary bracket but when it comes to content creation uh, influence uh, when it comes to youtubers you really don't know how much we make and you just see people spending money and you're thinking where are you getting all this money <laughs> and yeah so that's why I'm sitting down I'm doing this for future youtubers or people who are just uh, aspiring to get into the YouTube space but are scared which <sighs> youtubers are always spending influencers are always spending but no one tells us how much they really make okay now the first point that i want to make is that between youtube and instagram youtube does not have money but instagram is the real bag like there's money on instagram okay so i i believe like most youtubers in south africa would agree with me and i know we don't get paid the same but even I agree that there's no youtube number one youtube is time consuming it takes a lot to vlog to create videos for specifically youtube and it, it pays less 
than any other platform i feel like yes you can make money on youtube but it pays less and it's time consuming and growth on youtube is really really slow guys like it takes a lot unless you blow up and you become a big deal but i feel like my growth is I can't say slow but it's it's fair like I'm, I'm growing at a steady pace but when it comes to Instagram like there's so much money to be made on Instagram and I feel like the growth on Instagram is quicker not quick but it's quicker than uh, on um, YouTube now number two I'm gonna use the example that I did last month on how much I made on YouTube I told you guys I made 27,000 rands I even read I showed you the screenshots and not so the first part of youtube is that you're gonna get a standard salary like the 27k it's standard and the nice thing is that last month i made 27,000 rands. this month it's higher so it goes with me being consistent it goes with me um um my it goes with my numbers growing like if uh, last month when i made it 27k i was under 40,000 and now i'm sitting on 53,000 subscribers so the numbers are growing more people are watching ads and let me the more videos i put out there it's the more i make money so but we're gonna stick to the 27k oh i don't even know how to explain this properly but let me try let me take out a calculator so we can get like accurate numbers so on youtube we're gonna start with youtube we're gonna move to instagram so on youtube we're using last month's uh scenario so last month i got paid i made twenty seven thousand rands on youtube ne? and then i got i have sponsors i've been working with um skillshare for the for the past year and every month we sign like a six months contract i'm gonna put screenshots of how much they pay me and i'm only going to use old screenshots from last year before we made our new contract because like i said the more you grow the more you can negotiate to get a higher um paying um, routine like you can negotiate to make more money i'm gonna put it here it's just same thing that i'm looking at it's the same things you guys are gonna be looking at so i'm gonna use old numbers simply because i don't want to share my new paying uh thingy obviously it's higher but that's because from september i think here yeah, i was around this there's something thousand um that around 30 thousand now i'm on 50 so when we renew um i negotiated a higher pay so um i'm gonna use the old one because as much as i want to put my business out there some things i just want to make them like a rough estimate so let's convert the money so as you can see a uh, skills share is paying me five was paying me but we're gonna take it as if they're still paying me that amount i'm not gonna get share the new amount that i'm making because yeah i just don't want to <laughs> i know it's, it's higher but i feel like ish, i really pushed myself to uh, renegotiate with them so yeah so they were paying me 10,600 rands to feature um so i make one video for them in a month so it's also like my monthly salary so it's 10,600 so i made 27,300 um, plus ten thousand six hundred uh, so I've already made the seven thousand nine hundred from YouTube and skills share only now another thing that brings in money it's hair videos now I think currently I'm sitting with like five or six weeks that I'm going to prioritize and do all of them and I was supposed to do them last month but I didn't do them because I don't have time but on a normal a month i would do like one video two videos and three videos like now if i have six that's like i know that's my bag like i know okay if i do all these videos i'm going to have this much but out of the six hair videos that i have um I'm, I'm only going to do one so my minimum charge for a hair video with chinese you negotiate shall you negotiate like you push and at some point you have to learn to say no because when i started i was uh, charging them around 3.5 to 4,000 and now it has gone up to 6,000 rands so I charge 6,000 rands for a hair video 
that's minimum like yeah, i don't go below that i'd give him a price i'm like okay um i'll do the video for eight thousand we will fight yeah you're getting a wig hey hey what 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 but it's also nice because i know on the six thousand if i sell the wig like i've said it for two thousand one point five i know that six thousand plus two thousand that's already eight k but i'm not going to make that now so now we're sitting on forty three thousand nine hundred now that's how i make my money on youtube it's um youtube salary it's skills share and it's her videos now i know which it's standard like that's how i'm gonna get each month okay now we're sitting on forty three thousand nine hundred, and now we're gonna move on to the bag now we're talking money instagram is a bag 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 but it's also very a very tricky platform because um you have to negotiate your price like when uh brand managers come to you they'll ask oh can you please have your rate card your rate card is where you write your prices um this is how much i charge for this this is how much i charge for this you send them the rate card they come back with their own price <laughs> and for the sake of i know most brand managers watch my youtube channel i am not going to set the exact exact price because i'm gonna tell you guys the exact price price it okay um for one reel i charge 20k and then a brand manager is watching like oh so i wanted to pay her 25,000 rents for one reel and she charges 20k so next time i approach her i'm gonna down my prices so that's the risky part so i really I'm going to keep it vague when it comes to that to protect myself and my future bag <laughs> my future bag so on a monthly um, on a bad month if I say I'm having a bad month in content creation I would have like two um, paid posts on Instagram that's like having a bad month but if it's three four like that's a really really good month so I'm gonna take an example because I really want to be vague when it comes to Instagram I did a campaign I'm gonna use a campaign that paid late but if you can go to my Instagram page, you'll see that um, like every month you can see, okay, she does two or three posts, paid posts, paid posts and whatnot, right? So I'm going to use a late payment that came in last month on a gig I did on December. They paid me late, but it's a good thing because I had other campaigns that were paying on time. That's another thing with content creation. You will fight for payment. So they paid me late. It was a campaign. I'm going to put the whole price together. On the campaign, I made 41, was it 42? Let me check. Okay, so the whole campaign, um, I made 42,000 rands. Now, um, this, um, I'm going to be vague. The reason I'm using this because it's easy to be vague with this one. So, um, it was a reel, it was unboxing, like it was stories and stuff like that. So it was the whole campaign. It's not one post. I did not post one reel and get 43K. But there were a few other ones like unboxing, one picture and stuff like that. And the total came up to 42,000 rands. That's what I got on, um... But not his calculator cancelled everything that's what i got uh on last month i'm not gonna mention the other payments that i got because like i said i'd really really love to be as vague as possible when it comes to instagram guys ziabuya instagram like ziabuya and i felt like this thing of us not sharing prices on instagram as influencers is really really killing us because i can do a campaign for 20k we're doing the same campaign we're both posting one reel they'll pay me 20k and they'll pay the next person seven thousand rands so you must be you must learn to say no there's a, a brand that approached me last year jen and they wanted to do they wanted me to do five pictures né, in different outfits um and they wanted to pay me 7k and i was like no i'm not gonna do five outfits and five pictures for seven thousand rands i'm not doing that and i thought they would up the game and spend more money and they left me hanging i was like okay bye girl <laughs> So you must be able to stand your ground and know which it's possible that you will lose that campaign But if they really really want to work with you and you can prove your numbers Like my, by numbers I mean like when you post a, a, a reel it's the engagement are people engaging in your content Like if they see that's happening that's I think the biggest thing they want is engagement and if you have that you can 
play around with the money you can push your luck two thousand uh, forty two thousand on the campaign so that is the total amount that I make in a month now I am this money is not even I haven't even touched my weight loss um, business because that's just something separate I don't feel like it's not into content creation that's something that I started for myself so you can make around 85,000 rands like I'm saying I'm, I, there are things that I didn't add because I don't want to yeah I don't want it to be too accurate but it's around this amount and um, whew, it can be more like if I was one person who was dedicated like, like if you see girlies doing her videos they're getting paid I don't know how much they charge I charge 6k I don't negotiate but a price that I will not go below is 6k like I will not go below that much I'm sorry I'm not gonna do that I, there may be influencers with higher numbers than me that can charge up to 10,000 rands to do a heavy I feel like heavy videos are the bag and I'm so thankful for Skillshare so with this amount guys 85,000 rands you must also remember that it does get text influencers by uh, pay text too you have to have an accountant you have to um, um, pay tax like everyone else like if I want to buy something now they want to see my are you paying tax so let's say I want to buy a car if you're an influencer I've seen any influencer that has bought a car they pay tax so it's okay are you paying tax are you registered do you have a business uh, can you see your books like can you confirm on how much you make a month on thingy so this is a rough estimate but it's close to accurate sometimes it's less i don't want to lie sometimes it's more i don't want to lie depending on how good my month was i remember january i did not work and i just lived off payments from last year's gig like guys i yeah yeah it's, it's a blessing on its own this money does not even come close to what i was earning at government it doesn't come close but at the same time it is hard work like i'm telling you now i'm sitting with six let me show you like i feel like sometimes you guys will think i am lying uh, let me hide the name i'm just gonna put a screenshot here ne? um oh, guys yo yo um, i promise this 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 week i'm only doing i'm gonna start my vlog late um i'm only doing hair videos because at the same time i'm so happy that i'm getting so many hair videos but i don't want to lose business because of being late and trust me if you're an influencer one thing you won't have is time because these things are a lot they are really a lot so here is it like hello do you remember the week we sent you in february <laughs> When I tell you I have weeks, like they are probably, I'm looking like, I need to do these weeks, I need to do, and then something comes up, like something comes up, and now I'm buying clothes to get back into my Instagram, because I really want to, I feel like Instagram is the biggest bag I have, um, so I'm really going back to that, I, I love fashion, I love Instagram, but I feel like you guys made me, like I feel like I love YouTube too, okay, I don't know, I'm confused, like hello, do you remember the week we sent you in February, you said you will send me last month, why are you, why, why are you disappointed me? And this is just one of and I'm always apologizing like I'm so sorry. I was sick I'm so sorry. I was not at home like I make excuses, but I feel like I'm gonna do that in the coming week I'm just gonna concentrate on all my even now. I received a new um, Does it show my address? Even now I uh, received a new package for a her video um, I'm gonna put it under a certain month I put it under a certain month because the money that I get from that I have to put it in that month salary so that my payments align but is the money in content creation yes there is a lot of money to be made and I'm I feel like I'm small fish like I'm not like a big youtuber or a big Instagrammer I feel like there are people with over a hundred thousand subscribers and they're working hard if I'm making this much how much are they making 
and what I want to tell you is that don't chase the glamour don't chase the money really really have pay, uh, um, really really have um, passion for content creation and then you will you will you will master it like if you love it you'll master it if you don't love it it's gonna tire you out it's gonna wear you out because it's it's really really a lot and yeah guys that's how much oh wow that's how much i make um in a month basically roughly roughly um there are some really really good months there are some not so good i've never had like a bad month i think i've had like an average Nah, I've never had an army. I'm always getting okay. <laughs> Let me leave it there. But I thank God for every opportunity, for all your support and everything. And I hope the information I'm, I'm, I'm sharing now really helps someone or motivates someone who's in a similar space and really wanted to know, which if I put my time in this, will I benefit? Um, you definitely will. There's money to be made, but also that money requires you to have um, passion okay guys oh, I've been speaking for such a long time um, I'm having juice I even forgot uh, I'm going to on the end of this vlog here and then just quickly edit this part and um, upload maybe you guys will get this around five six the um, soonest thank you thank you so so much for watching if you have um, enjoyed this video please um, hit that subscribe button we are on our way to 60,000 subscribers I am begging you please subscribe guys I cannot wait to get to 60k I'm aiming for 100 but step by step so the next step is 60,000 subscribers okay guys so we've come to the end of this video i love you guys so much may god bless you abundantly may god open the doors that you are knocking on uh, may god hear your prayers and may he answer them as pay your heart's desires and i believe like there's nothing above prayer there's nothing above god and his timing so if it's not happening now trust his timing i'm gonna leave you with those words i love you guys so much i'll see you guys in my next one bye